What is the vertical intercept? The vertical line is this here, right? This is the vertical line. Where does the line cross the uh, cross the y-axis? You have to be aware of the scale. Be very careful with the scale here. This is the balance left on the gift card. Number of cups of coffee that he has ordered. What is what is the x-intercept? I mean, the, the vertical intercept. Give me the coordinate for this point. 30. Zero comma? 30. Zero 30. Very nice. Did everyone get 30? Excellent. Yes. Zero 30. Now, what does it mean? Can someone tell me what that means in terms of this gift card? That he hasn't used it. When he hasn't used it, how much money is in it? $30. Very nice. That's what that means. Before he used the card, he had $30 in the gift card. So you would write a, a simple sentence like that. What does it mean in the situation? When he hasn't used the card, there were $30 in the card. So you write that down. Make sure you write that down. Find the average rate of change. What's another word for average rate of change? For the for the for a line. When I ask you find the average rate of change, that's another word for? Talking about the slope? That's exactly right. The average rate of change is, is the slope. Find the slope of this line. You can use the formula or you can use the graph. Again, I, I'm big on using the graph if I if you know how to uh, how to read the units here. This we're going from 30 to 16. How many units are we going down here? From 30 to 16 we go. 14 down. How many units am I going over? From 0 all the way to 8. So what's the slope? Negative 14 over 8. And when we... Can someone divide 14 by 8? I think in this case it would make a little more sense if we just look at the decimal. What's 14 divided by 8? What is it? Negative 1.75. That's a slope. Now look at the units because you're supposed to explain what it means in this situation. What are the 14 here? What are the, what are the units in this axis? But what are the units? What are these? Dollars. Dollars, Dollars per? What are these? Per cups. Per cup. Or cup of so coffee. what does this tell you? What does this indicate? Each cup is a dollar seventy-five cents. That's exactly what it means. Very nice.